Hi, Playmate! Welcome back to the Play Circle, and welcome to the first Animation Monday video on the Play Circle's channel! In today's learning session, we are exploring the solar system. This is gonna be fun, so let's get started. So, what is the solar system? It is a system where objects orbit the sun. You know, that bright circle in the sky? Yeah, that's the sun. And, hmm, orbit? What does that mean? The meaning of orbit is a repeating path that one object in space takes around another one. Did you know that we live in the solar system on one planet? Can you guess which planet that is? That's right, Earth! Let's count the planets to see how many there are in the solar system. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight! Good job! There are eight total planets that orbit the sun. The first planet is Mercury. Mercury is the smallest planet and the closest to the sun. Mercury has no moons. The second planet is Venus. Venus is the hottest planet in the solar system. Ouch! And like Mercury, Venus has no moons. The third planet is Earth. Earth is the only planet with liquid, and we also call it our home. Earth has one moon. The fourth planet is Mars. Mars is really dusty and cold with a thin atmosphere. It would be really hard to breathe if you went there on vacation. Mars has two moons. The fifth planet is Jupiter. Jupiter is twice the size of other planets and is also known as a gas giant. Jupiter has between 80 to 95 moons. Wow, imagine if the Earth had that many moons. The sixth planet is Saturn. Saturn is surrounded by a series of icy rings and is known to be the first planet to have over 100 moons. Saturn has 145 moons. The seventh planet is Uranus. Uranus rotates on a tilt, so it looks like it's sideways all the time. Uranus has 27 moons. Last but not least, the eighth planet is Neptune. Neptune is the smallest gas giant and the farthest from the sun. Neptune has 14 moons. Now that we named all of the planets, let's go over them one more time. Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. And here's a fun fact about the solar system. Did you know that the solar system used to have nine planets? The ninth planet was called Pluto. Up until 2005, we all knew that Pluto was a planet. But in August of 2006, the IAU found that Pluto didn't exactly meet all three of the characteristics that would consider it a planet. 1. Planets must orbit the Sun in a perfect circle, which Pluto does. 2. Planets must be a sphere, meaning it has to look like the other planets, round and in the shape of a circle. Pluto also exhibits this, so what's the issue? Well, the third characteristic is that planets must have a clear path when orbiting the sun, meaning Pluto has to clear away all of the surrounding rocks while orbiting the sun, like the other planets do. But unfortunately, Pluto is way too small and it's almost impossible for Pluto to clear out its path around the sun. And that is why Pluto is no longer considered a planet. 
Now, Pluto is known as a dwarf planet. For completing today's Animation Monday session, I present to you a certificate of completion. Congratulations on completing today's Animation Monday session about the solar system. Now you know that there are eight planets in the solar system. Good job, Playmate. You should be very proud of yourself. Thank you so much for joining me today. I had so much fun. If you enjoyed our first Animation Monday, please give this video a thumbs up so I know that you also enjoyed it. I'm really sad that today's learning session is ending, but that's okay. I'll see you in our next video. Make sure to check out our other videos on the Play Circles channel. That's all for today. Goodbye, Playmate.